Look what I got. Two. Oh yeah. Welcome back to the Hose Haven. We got a lot of cool stuff to do today. So I think the first thing I want to do is go ahead and commit to defeating this Black Widow. As you can see, I already have my smoothies in the hot bar, but I don't know what sort of weapon it's weak against. Let's have a quick look at our data. So I've kept track of everything I've peeped so far, like red soldier ants, rusty, water fleas, and everything else you see here. However, one thing I failed to do was to peep the Black Widow herself the last time we went over there. However, I did peep a Black Widow link, and they appear to be weak to spicy. I don't have any spicy weapons yet, so I'm gonna try to make one of those since I have all the spicy globs and see what we can come up with. I may just make myself a spicy axe, or I can make myself a toenail scimitar. That's what I'm thinking. That's it, I'm doing it. Ah, oh, man, here it is. It's all covered in lint and whatever this guy was scratching. It's weird to think that I'm getting ready to kill a giant spider with somebody's toenails. That's okay. Let's get it upgraded. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. Let's keep going. Level 5. Let's make it spicy. Nice. Now I've got a spicy sword. Today, we have to scout out where the other Black Widows are because I can't go back under the shed. It's just too far. If I get in there, it gets too dark, there's too many enemies, I run out of food, and if I get hurt, it's a long way back. So, we're gonna go poke around and see what we can find. I have a couple of leads, but we'll have to change our outfits and head over that way right now. Here's our short list of things to do today. Number one, locate another Black Widow. She's been on my list ever since I defeated Muldork, and I'm tired of talking about it. Let's do this. And number two, defeat the Black Widow. I know she's one of many, but knocking out one will feel real good. Let's not waste any more time! Alright, we're over here at the grill spill. Now, I have adorned myself in antlion armor, I am using a heat-resistant trinket, and I've adjusted some of my mutations to ensure that I can handle the heat. I've seen a lot of wolf spiders over here, and if I had to guess, there should be a Black Widow nearby. Now, I would also like to get some more ever-burning charcoal. We'll pull this out. We'll get some of those, and I should be able to resist this heat a lot better. Oh yeah, I'm already feeling pretty good. Let's grab these, because I'm probably going to have to make another torch here soon. Man, this is really, really hot. It's really, really risky. Man, look how fast it's going up. All right, take a break. Oh man, I remember these guys. I remember these two spiders hiding underneath the grill spill here and it's starting to get dark. Uh, that makes me worried. All right, now that I have weapon options though, lots of different, you know, spicy minty weapons, let's see what they're weak to. Ah, here's a great chance to test out my spicy sword. Don't look now, let's do this. Look what I got. Two. a little reckless but I got him all right it's a little dark under here and I'm pretty sure I've dug up all the treasure I'm going to find but let's poke around a little bit more some of these darker creepier places tend to have giant spiders nothing says you're a man like killing a giant roly-poly here we go about myself. Man, so if I was looking for a giant spider who liked dark, damp places, 
Under the shed would be top notch. Of course, anything laying in the yard for a long period of time can become home to any type of animal or insect. It's sort of weird that I haven't ran into any snakes out here. Now I've got reason to believe that we might find something underneath the charcoal bag. It is already a little hot. I also haven't explored around here very much at all. Ooh, wow. Well, why is it hot? Holy smokes. That's because it's been burnt out. Man, I bet I can find a tooth or something in here as well. I've not even popped my head in here before. So cool. Cool, let's take a quick lap and see if we can't find anything in here at all. I imagine there are some teeth in here I can find. Wait, what is that? Holy smokes, is that a, is that a weapon? What is that? I can get a better look from far away. I wonder if I can hop up here. All right, it's really hot. Flaming sword. What does that mean, mastering the secret? What are you doing? Oh, I've got to defend the sword. I get it. I got to get off of this though. Oh boy. There's a lot going on in here all of a sudden. Oh no, they're hurting the sword. Get off the sword. Oh man, they're, they're wrecking it. Come on, I need that for something. Probably. Oh, I gotta get out, I gotta get out. Too hot, too hot, too hot. Okay, I know that ladybird larvae are susceptible to a violent stabbing just like that, but there were a lot of them in here and I was really struggling to mitigate some of their sizzle. These guys are hot. This bag is hot. I was able to kill several with the crossbow, so I may have to commit to that. Let's go put our hands on this sword again, summon the fight, and I bet we'll be able to handle it. Give me this sword. Would you look at the damage I caused in here? All right, let's gather up all these bug parts. I'm pretty sure I can make them into glue to repair all of my weapons, which is really nice. And we for sure have gotten our 10 bug quota. Oh, but look at this. I learned the recipe for this sword. I didn't pick it up. I learned how to make it. The spicy Coltana. That's it. I'm making one. I mean, it's cool that I have this, not gonna lie but a katana sounds way cooler than a toenail. You know what I'm saying? Now, here I am on the top. Check this out. Man, this was a pretty good find. Got a new sword recipe. Still no Black Widow. I don't know, maybe I can check under that bag. It's pretty close to the porch. It is getting dark again. Maybe I should run over there to the bike tire camp, get a good snooze, and then have a look underneath the fertilizer bag. There was something really cool in this bag. bad news is that I'm still outfitted for spicy fighting. You know, fighting over there beside the charcoal grill. I was expecting to kind of find something over there, but I didn't. Let's make our way over here to the fertilizer bag and maybe... hey oh, don't... Oh, I gotta get one of those. But they're so fast and I'm so slow. All right, I think this is it. It's kind of hard to tell up close. Yeah, this is it. This is it. All right, anything lying in the yard will typically draw nasty things to live underneath it. I mean, maybe we can pop down here. I guess I can get back out over there somewhere. So, we'll just pop down and see what we can get below it. Oh, dust mites. All right, the dust mites are gone. It doesn't look like we can get under this bag at all. All right, let's just run out of here. We're just gonna aggro run out of here, find our way back home and empty our pockets. This looks like it goes up because we were not successful in finding a black widow over here. And I'm sort of interested in making that sword. Let's head over there and do that now. You know one thing I haven't done? I haven't used any of the molars I found. Let's go do that real fast. And here we are. This one looks good. It's time. This one? 
go. And this one. Ready. Man, that's pretty good. Now let's get back to the base, swap over our armor, and continue our hunt for a Black Widow. Now it looks like we have everything we need to make the spicy Coltana. You know I want one. Man, nice. Look at this thing. It's two-handed. This is so awesome. It's just like the Antlion Greatsword. Let's upgrade it. Nice, I got it super leveled up. This is so great. Okay, now I have my Black Ox armor back on and I want to try to swing back over to the toolbox again where I saw wispy spider webs. We didn't find anything underneath the charcoal bag like I anticipated, which would have normally been a really good spot for a Black Widow just based on it having sat there for a long time. But underneath the lawnmower, we saw something really good. Let's go have a look. Wait, what the heck is this? I've not seen this before. We've got a roly-poly there. Is this a dead animal with gum in its lungs? All right, well, we can't pass up the gum. But man, this is weird to look at. I mean, I guess I made this guy mad. Let's finish him off. No, are they both after me? This is gonna be rough. Let's finish this guy first. Nice, the other one passed out from all the poison. And there's my gum. Worth it. I mean, what the heck was this? A rat? A cat? A possum? Not my cat, not my problem. Whoa. This is toothy paradise. How do I get in there? There's five of them in there. Man, it's buried. I've got to find another way in there. Okay. This is a whole new world of new things. I really need to set up an outpost over here so I know how to get back. Okay, I see where I am now. There's the bird bath. There's Burgle right over there. I've made my way all the way to the rightmost side of the yard. Is that a castle? I mean, I have to check out what's on the inside of the car, right? Could be anything in here. Like upgrade materials! All right, while we're here, let's go ahead and set up a quick camp. It won't take long at all. There, just a few more pieces of dry grass and I'll be able to set up my campfire. But I found something over here that I thought was really, really cool. Perhaps an underground access point to that bottle full of tooths that I saw. Uh, teeth. Teeth that I saw. Not tooths. I can read. Yeah, look at this. Here's the bottle cap. I can just eke down inside, I think. Oh yeah, there's gonna be good stuff in here. Maybe I'll even find the Black Widow. Torch out. A dead guy. That doesn't look good. Oh yeah, we did it! We made it! We found all five! Now this is a really great place to have found. It would be really cool if I could set up a zip line right here from here to the tree. That way I don't have to cut around the entire yard like this. This is a great spot to get it started. I know we're off track from our original quest today. Black Widows are hard enough to find. This will be a great step in covering the yard without having to waste all my time. Let's get it set up. There. Man, that took forever. Almost two days of traveling just to get this guy up and ready. Now, I wonder if I can connect it to anything that's pre-existing or if I'm gonna have to hop across the water and build a second zip line. Let's see. All right, it looks like I can make one from the other side of the upper yard. Let's go ahead and do that. Works perfectly. I'm gonna have to hop across and make one. I can't connect to any of the other ones there, but this is so great. Let's do that real fast and then we'll assess our list. Okay, I'm up there by the punch box right there and I've got another workstation set up right here. I've got a pocket full of silk and a pocket full of clay. This shouldn't be too hard. There, we've got it. Man, zip lining across the water. That's a whole new fear of heights right there. Welp, we didn't find our Black Widow. And of course we couldn't achieve number two, which was to kill it. But we did find another berry bush, which is really nice. A whole new other section of the yard that has me asking a lot of questions. Namely, what's inside of this giant castle? It's gonna have to wait though. I've gotta pull together some resources and walk the perimeter of this thing. 
I don't want to walk in there and get trapped by something evil. We'll come back to that Black Widow list on tomorrow. For now, we have to think and prepare. <laughs>